So here it is, my favourite drive of 2018, the McLaren Senna. Sadly, none of the rest of the crew will be able to drive it today because today is actually two months ago. And the crew's camped up in Victoria, whereas I'm in Budapest in Hungary. Tough luck, guys. So sad. Just to twist the space-time continuum a little harder, I didn't actually drive it today either, but two months ago in Portugal. It's like the Where's Wally of supercars. So given that I've cheated just a little, I've had to come up with another choice for my car of 2018. But my other pick for 2018 is the Mercedes-AMG G63, or G-Wagon, which I used to crush much of the French Mediterranean landscape at its international launch back in June. Sure, it wasn't the smartest, the quickest, or the most sensible thing I drove all year, but in over 20 years of journalism, I can't ever remember laughing so much at the launch of a car. Loaded up on the brakes, and 900 newton metres sort of cocks the nose into the air, and it launches towards the horizon with a ludicrous amount of fanfare, and with a soundtrack that feels like you've been pinned to the PA system of an ACDC concert. It's hilarious when you stick it into a corner because it's like some sort of high performance apartment block where you're steering it from the third floor lounge room window. <laughs> I know it's antisocial, it's thirstier than an Airbus A380, and somewhere a baby dolphin is choking on a rainbow. But for me, the G63 was the largest swig of antidote to motoring mediocrity of 2018. 